you thought Vampire Weekend was bad. Well, this is Tornado Weekend. Anyway, here's a uh, little quick preview of my latest project. And it's a uh, solar dehydrator. Sun can shine in on three sides here. Well, actually a little bit more. And uh, got some computer fans under here. They're about half an amp each. Two of them with uh, furnace filter material over them to make sure no dust gets inside this. And uh, this means I can hook up an 18 watt solar panel and during the day these fans won't even take the battery down. And forces the air inside and comes out through these vents right here. Even with all this wind outside, we're doing pretty good here. I can feel the hot air pumping out of the inside and they're screening over the exhaust. It's been out here only a little while. It's reading 94 degrees in here and 16% humidity. There's the battery pack down below. And it's about a somewhere around a 50 amp hour battery, so it should be able to run these fans for, well, supposedly 50 hours, so, you know, you'll get a good couple days out of it running non-stop. So this dehydrator will work even if the sun is not shining on it. So you could take this rain cover off the top And you could run this thing indoors with just these fans because the fans alone and the airflow will actually do your dehydrating for you. Okay, and we open our door. And I've Got a full air seal around the door and nine shelves inside. So we're going to do some tests in the next couple days. I'm just going to build a uh, like a grid in here out of uh, little hardwood dowels, and I'm going to hang some meat in here, uh, kind of old-fashioned style, and see how long it takes to uh, make some beef jerky in here. There's the vent holes at the top. And the only thing I'm missing is a door latch. I gotta go look for something in town on Monday. So yeah, sneak preview. New solar cooker coming soon. It's five o'clock, sun's I'm getting a little low there today, so 